Hello everyone. Welcome to this video lesson. Let us see what is given in this problem. The problem is basing on the relative velocity and the boat crossing a river. It is given in the problem that the velocity of the water in a river is 2 km per, 2 km per hour and the width of the river is 400 meter per second. Let us try analyzing that point first. So it is that is like this this is how the water in a river is passing with a velocity of 2 km per hour and river is having a certain width this is how the width of the river is it is given that that width of the river is 400 meters width of the river is nothing but equal to 400 meters now a boat is trying to cross the river starting from a particular point the boat is always driving itself in the opposite direction with a speed of 8 kmph so the boat has to cross a distance of 400 meters with a speed of 8 km per hour then I can calculate displacement of that boat displacement of that boat is equal to velocity of the boat into time displacement rate has to cover is 400 meters and then the velocity that is given as 8 kmph I have to convert that kilometer per hour into meter per second 5 by 18 multiplied by time so I can say the time taken to cross the river is 400 into 18 by 5 into 8 seconds during that particular period as the river is passing from left to right that will push the water away that will push the boat away so that the boat won't be able to reach the exact opposite position rather it will miss the opposite position and reach a point O dash that distance between them where it is missing the distance between them is actually called drift so drift is simply it is supposed to reach a point O but because of the push of the river it has reached a point O dash the gap between them is called as drift and be clear that drift happened in the horizontal direction because of the velocity of the river VR so if I have to calculate the drift who is in the horizontal direction I have to write velocity in the horizontal direction that's nothing but velocity of the river and the time for which the journey happened velocity of the river is given in the problem as 2 kmph that's nothing but equal to 2 into 5 by 18 converting them into meter per second and the time we have already calculated as 400 into 18 by 5 into 8 we can simplify this further 5 and 5 can be cancelled 18 and 18 can be cancelled 2 is 4 times that's nothing but equal to 400 by 4 that's nothing but equal to 100 meter so while the boat trying to reach the exact opposite position by driving it always to the opposite destination the river will drift it to a new position O dash you won't be able to reach O because of the push of the river which is called as drift and you will be reaching a position 100 meters away from the destination that's it thank you for watching